What's up guys, Hooked on Fishing here, and this is our first video, so, um, hello, my name is Alan, if you didn't know. The friend I'll be doing it with is Paul Christie, um, he's a good friend of mine, and I'll also be um, introducing a lot of my other friends. <clears throat> Excuse my voice, sorry, I've got cold, um, got a bad one, but yeah, I thought I'd bring you a video for you anyway, guys. Alright, this video is a tutorial on how to make this very, very simple hair rig, but also it's very effective. What you're going to need is, um, I'm using braid. Nice skin, coated braid. You can use like monofilament or um, fluorocarbon or anything else like that. But I prefer to use, I prefer, prefer to use braid, you need to work with. <clears throat> Second thing is a hook of some sort. This is, um, uh, curve shank hook, as you can see. Make sure it's nice and sharp. Second thing is a swivel. I'm sorry about that. Um, this next bit's optional, you don't have to, but I prefer to use a tiny bit of shrink tube to um, put around the knot, knot of the hook. and the um, eyelet so it keeps nice and inside so you don't get it. And some nice sharp scissors to cut it all. So, let's begin. Right, to get started, first of all you want to cut um, a reasonable sized amount of braid. I would say, depend, depending on the rig you want, but I'm going to make mine fairly long. About that. Ugh, sorry. That's not needed anymore, so we can check off the side. Right now you've got your um, braid. First you want to tie is a simple um, overhand knot, but loop style, so double up like that. No, I'm not going to lie, I always have trouble with this, so I might struggle a bit there, then you want to just do simple. Right, right I'm just going to go get my um, needle back in a sec, guys. No bad guys. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, just a little quick tip for you. If you are struggling to get the loop, um, the little loop through your hole, what I like to do is use a baiting needle like that. Look, that pulls it through for you. Simple, done. So I'm just gonna get a bit of blunt bit of the scissors. Hang on, guys. Sorry. Right, once you've got it nice and tight, snip. Careful with this tag end, you want to cut the main line. Well, the main, like, bit of the braid. I feel good now, don't I? Yeah, this is only that sharp, to be honest. So. But yeah, once you've done that, you should end up with a nice little loop like that. So once you've got your overhand knot there, you've still got the rest of your line. Now uh, this is where the hook comes in. Alright, you want to get your hook and put it in the back of the eye, not the front, it has to be the back for this rig. Put it all the way through. Now some people put a boilie on, on the end of that, so they can like, measure it out perfectly. But to be honest, I don't really need to, so I can do it roughly. Alright, but that's enough for me. Then you want to hold the braid against the back of the shank and then wrap the line up the shank of the hook. Do you think enough done, done enough? I think that's about enough. Put that a bit. Once you've done that, see look. You wanna pull it, go back, get the other loose end, go back through the back of the eye and then pull nice and tight it's alright guys friend for you decide to skype me <laughs> and then there's your simple hair rig
this knot here, it's called a knotless knot because you tied it without using any knots, you've just put the two together, look. And that's a very strong hook point, as you can see. Looks so nicely, so that's gonna hook the lip. <coughs> right, once you've done that, sorry about that, guys, you want to get your swivel, and then, that doesn't matter what knot you use, but I use a very simple one. And that's where you go. Hang on. Now you put the put it through, then you go. You twist the little tag in round the line as many times as you can. And then once you've done that, you go back through the little hole that. Hang on. That little hole in the main line in the um, braid there, not the, not the swivel hole in the braid, and then pull that. So that looks like that, and then wet it a bit, a bit some lifer, and then pull tight, and you've got a nice little knot there. And now you want to do is just snap that snip that tag, tag end off, and then your swivel's all tied. Okay, guys, what I failed to do was um, put the shrink tube on this line before I put the swivel on, but the thing is, you don't need it. The only thing I was going to use it was to make it a little bit neat and um, keep that knot hitting away, but it doesn't make the rig any stronger than I know of, so. But there is a very simple hair rig tied. Now, all you do is um, boil on a bait needle, hook on there, slide the boil onto that, and then you're fishing. Thanks guys for watching. Um, comment if you have any other ideas for tutorial videos if you want any. And um, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Thanks guys and goodbye.